I have nothing. Nothing, nothing don't make me close one more door. I don't want to hurt anymore. Stay in my arms if you dare. I must die. Imagine you there. Don't walk away from me now. Hi, I'm Ariana DeBose, and I am going to play a game of song association with L. I will be given a word, and I will have a mere 10 seconds to sing or rap the word in the song. I don't have high hopes for my success in this game, but alas, I will be a good sport. Oh, I have seen the show many times. Um, I enjoyed Olivia Rodrigo very much recently, but I, I won't cheat and use only her answers, I promise. But before we get to the game, be sure to check out West Side Story in theaters. Wear a mask, stay safe, but also get your popcorn and go see it, because it's really good on a big screen. Trust me. Mm. Dear Lord, she's rusty. Should have maybe slept a little more. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. She's fine. Great. Stay. I want you to stay. All along, it was a feeling. A cold head, hot headed, believing. Something like that. Rihanna, stay. Chance. If you change your mind, I'm the first in line. Honey, I'm still free. Take a chance on me. Mama Mia, can't tell me nothing about ABBA. Oh, I am a thriving fan of the ABBA resurgence. Um, I, Drew Story, tried very hard to get tickets. Um, to their, you know, new concert realness. Um, and I'm on a waiting list. So I don't normally use my privilege, but if there's anyone out there who can help me out with tickets, that would be really great, because that's like a dream. ABBA, love you. Place. There's a place for us. Somewhere a place for us. Peace and quiet and open air. Wait for us somewhere, West Side Story, at your service. You know what? I am so excited for people to see West Side Story because it's a big, ginormous, glorious reimagination of a movie musical made in the style of all the films we love from that golden old Hollywood age. It's, it's a true cinematic experience. And not only that, it's... It is timeless and it's vivacious and colorful and the story is just as relevant now as it was in 1961. Um, it's just as relevant now. Our source material is Romeo and Juliet. Lots of relevant themes in that, lots of relevant themes in West Side and we have so many beautiful additions to our script. Beautiful Latina people finally uh, being given the opportunity to tell our story with our voices. Um, and it's and it's told through, you know, the lens of one of the greatest directors of all time. And he did an absolutely beautiful, respectful job. And that's why there are many reasons why I'm excited for you to see West Side Story. Gold. Gold finger, he's the man, the man with the mightiest touch. <laughs> A spiderest touch. Goldfinger, the James Bond movie. It's really good. Hot. Gotta have some hot stuff, baby, this evening. 
I need your hearts to baby tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. That would be my Queen Donna Summer. I played Disco Donna Summer on Broadway. I was Tony nominated for that. Ugh, what a disco diva. Like the mother of uh, an entire sound. Oh, well, there are two that like live on, live rent free, as the kids would say. In my head. It's so good, it's so good, it's so good, it's so good, it's so good. Yes, it's called I Feel Love, brought to you by Donna Summer and Giorgio Moroder, covered by Sam Smith, just for the delineation. And MacArthur's paw is melting in the dark. All the sweet green icing flowing down. Someone left the cake out in the rain. You're welcome. Fast. You in a fast car. I got a ticket to anywhere. Maybe we can make a decision. Leave tonight. Da, 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 da. Tracy Chapman, fast car. I mean, if you were to ask my Nana, she would say the song that made me fall in love with music was a whole new world from Aladdin, because I sang it over and over again until she wanted to hit her head against a wall. Um, but the song that I remember made me fall in love with music was I Have Nothing by Whitney Houston from The Bodyguard, or sung by Whitney Houston from The Bodyguard. It was the drama for me. Oof, drama. I have nothing. Nothing, nothing, don't make me close one more door. I don't want to hurt anymore. Stay in my arms if you dare. I must die. Imagine you there. Don't walk away from me now. Don't walk. Yeah. You're welcome. It's drama. It's drama. That might have been sharp flattened in between, but I felt it in my spirit. West. Go west. Go west. And that's the only lyric I know, but I know it's from Priscilla, Queen of the Desert. Go west. Side. Nobody's on nobody's side. Again, chess. Just go, check out the Jessica Vosk version of that song. Quality, quality cover, if I do say so myself. Story. But these stories don't mean anything. If you got no one to tell them to, it's true. I was made for you. Wait, all of these lines across my face tell you the story of who I am. There you go. Story. Brandy Carlisle. Queen. Well, I love this. I love that question. If I was to release my own song, I think my dream collaboration... Oh my God. Would probably be with like, I don't know. <laughs> Whoever wrote Wrecking Ball for Miley Cyrus and Barbara Streisand. <laughs> Who wants to make that happen? I know, eclectic taste. <laughs> no? Okay, it's fine. Just me. Easy. Take it easy. I had no time to choose what I chose to do. So take it easy on me. Uh, Adele, easy. I love Adele with my whole heart. In fact, my mother and I, anytime Adele has a concert, we like literally seek out tickets. Like it's the last thing we're gonna do on this planet. We went and saw her. I think it was her 25 album concert at Madison Square Garden. And she did the most beautiful cover of uh, an Alison Krauss tune. Oh my God. She, I, I ride the subway and weep to Adele. She is everything. But we could have had it all, rolling in and deep. Really gets me. 
speaks to my whole being. I can't love you in the dark. It feels like we're oceans apart. That's a good one. But I'm really vibing with, oh my God, I can't believe it that all other people in the world. It's so good. Oh my God, it's a vibe. Cross. How do we know who we are unless we cross the line? It's from Bring It On The Musical. <laughs> we reach for what we love. And when we fall, we know first place doesn't matter at all. Bring It On was my Broadway debut. I was 21 years old. That was 10 years ago. My word. Broadway found me, actually. I, uh... I had just uh, been voted off of So You Think You Can Dance, and I moved to New York City trying to redeem myself uh, for myself. It was really just about me proving that I was still good at dancing. And I uh, auditioned for many, many shows, received many, many no's, and then Andy Blankenbuehler hired me for Bring It On. And that was the show that taught me how to make shows and also taught me how to potentially sing some pop songs. So that was super helpful, very grateful. And that was my first encounter with Lin-Manuel Miranda. I didn't roll my R very good. Lin-Manuel Miranda. <laughs> He's going to be really mad that I did it like that. It's not impressive. Lin's like a big brother. He's a big fat nerd. And guess what? So am I. But he's potentially one of the most creative people you'll ever have in a room. And he's, I remember when I was auditioning for Bring It On, he actually, <laughs> he came in late, if I remember correctly. But he was just like, you sound really good from the hallway. And I was like, work. Ah, uh, I got one. <laughs> I sounded good from the hallway. So it was great. Dance. Oh. Dance. Woo. Nothing left for me to do but dance. Ooh, all these bad times I'm going through, cause dance. Got canned heat in my heels tonight, baby. Uh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Just dance, dance, dance. Pretty. I feel pretty. Oh, so pretty. I feel pretty and witty and gay. And I pity any girl who isn't me today. Uh, that would be... Uh, I feel pretty from West Side Story, and I really enjoy the pronunciation of I Feel Pretty by Rachel Zegler. Beautifully sung. Song. My gift is my song, and this one is for you. And you can tell everybody that this is your song. Forever. It's in West Side Story. Because I can hear Rachel say, forever. Oh, only you, you're the only thing I'll see forever. In my eyes, in my words, and in everything I do. Nothing else but you, ever. That is the balcony scene. Look at that. Who says I only read the parts with Anita in it? What now? I think that I made a respectable showing and I think that I might have offered up some songs that perhaps the general audience may not be aware of. So we learned something from each other. I also think I might have uh, severely embarrassed myself and now all of you know what an absolute idiot I am and I thank you for your time. Thank you for watching me play Song Association with Elle, because I know that you really did enjoy this. And for more videos like this one, click subscribe to Elle.